Whether it's all-time leading scorer Chris Monroe or career assist leader Shantae Rogers, three-point record holder TJ Thompson, or Joe McDonald, who ranks third all-time at GW in games played. There's a theme. They are all locally grown. And as McDonald tells it, playing so close to his home in Virginia gave him an edge. Every home game felt a little more special, to be honest. Um, and, and being comfortable, I think, is is key. Is is, is is what anyone would want uh, when they when they move to that next stage in life, and uh, it just made the transition so much easier. This season, Jamie Christian's roster features nine student athletes hailing from the DMV. The veteran coach has a lengthy track record of scouring the globe for prospects built to thrive in his mayhem system, but he wants to start in his own backyard, tapping into a hoops hotbed with a rich history of players succeeding at the highest levels. You know, there's a national championship team waiting out there for us, for guys that are local, and we got to do a great job of, of, of capturing their hearts and their minds as they're growing up and, and getting them to stay home. And, you know, we have one of the best universities in the world. You know, we want these guys staying right here. We want them playing basketball right here and, and growing our product. And there's no reason that the focus shouldn't start here and then expand outside if we're not able to bring a certain kind of characteristic into our program. Christian's last two recruiting classes have been comprised entirely of young men hailing from the district, Maryland or Virginia, including first year's Noel Brown from Leesburg, Virginia, Williamsport, Maryland's Lincoln Ball, and Tyler Brelsford from Ellicott City, Maryland and Baltimore's Mount St. Joseph High School, where he played with another g newcomer in LSU transfer James Bishop. A Virginia native, Christian has a deep appreciation for DMV hoops, and he's built strong recruiting ties around the region through his success scouting, signing, and bringing out the best in local players over the past decade. But it goes beyond efforts to recruit just locally. There's also a mission that goes well beyond the court, as the program seeks to connect current student athletes with alumni in the area through the program's mentoring initiative to set up opportunities for life after basketball. And that was one of the reasons why I chose GW was because not only could I satisfy my needs on a division one level or my pro aspirations, but I was also uh, also satisfied need as far as my um, ambition in business and, 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 and to, you know, get into that community here in D.C. That was one of the reasons why I thought D.C. Uh, and GW was a perfect was a perfect fit. I didn't want to go anywhere. The best high school basketball in the country is right here. And so we want to do a great job of keeping these guys home or bringing these guys back home um, if they go outside the district before. And that's been a focus of ours um, from day one here. You know, we're trying to, we're not only selling Washington, D.C., we're selling George Washington, the opportunity that it gives for them. So, you know, we're just trying to do a great job of keeping the best basketball players in the country right here. It's all part of the process. Raised here to stay here and play here with the ultimate goal of raising a banner for D.C.